Polari is one of those secret languages that tells us about a subculture. Born sadly of necessity. We're gay. London in 1960. Homosexuality was illegal until 1967. The gay community at that time felt it needed a code for protection. Quite a lot of Polari going on in the 60s. And they had to find a way to, to communicate. So you'd find your way around Polari. Strange coded language. It's a mixture of different types of languages. So you just slip into Polari, it was much easier because um, they didn't know what you were talking about. That you could talk on the top of the bus about um, this guy and uh, or what you've done the night before and so on and no one else around you could understand what you were talking about. Especially if it was sexual, you didn't want them to know what you were talking about. And you'd both slip into this Polari. I don't, I don't mean that every word was Polari, but all the important words, it was mixed up enough with ordinary, because a lot of it is foreign languages came off all the ships in, in the docks in the East End, and they had all these different words for different things, and they were, so they had different kinds, all different languages mixed up in the Polari. When we liberated ourselves, we realised, yes, it was a fucking drag. The whole thing was terrible and awful, and it made everybody uh, very secretive and very sort of suspicious. And you never thought, oh God, I'm so oppressed, I can't speak about myself. You just did it. The boldest little boner eek And when you charm me it leaves me weak You got a boner eek Boner boner Heard it from Lily Law Boner boner You're in the life once more But I love you so well you can clean my kitchen And get your carts a pitching Yes, I love your boner eek, boner eek, boner eek, boner eek, boner eek. Oh, your lallies look like dots, and you got nanty cots. But I love. I love your bona. Here, give us a vada of that dolly old eek. Ooh, yeah!